Alright, baby, this is Bucket, and we're going to be coaching CPU1 again, the Pac-Man, right? Uh, in the pac Discord server, right now, uh, in about in a few days, there's going to be a, um, a uh, crew battle against Pac-Man versus Bowser mains, right? In the Discord servers. Uh, this is a friendly against one people in the, back, the pac Bowser's Discord servers, and we don't like this guy, right? Well, it's a friendly, but for right now, we like this guy. So, ba if there is a character that you do not want to have the advantage state ever... It's going to be Bowser. You want to keep Bowser in disadvantage state as... When you have a disadvantage, you want to keep him in there for as long as you can. It's very important to find what his escape options are. His air dodging, double jump. You, you want to keep a disadvantage, like, constantly. That's, like, the only... And neutral, it's still scary. And advantage state Bowser, don't want to play with him. Because you're on top of the platform, like right now, he's under you, he's going to he's gonna side B you on top of the platform. And even if you're right here, he side B's you, he gets his DI, you have to like DI fight him. And you, you do it, because he's going to try and put you on the platform so he can kill you early, right? Uh, looking for that, because side B is a kill. Um, down B at ledge, you got to roll, you got to react to it, right? Um, don't jump. <laughs> and uh, fire is just a free uh, let's trap. Not a whole lot you can do about fire, but it, you take a few percent, don't worry about it, re ledge, and then fight again, right? Not just say there, uh, keep uh, keep advantage state. Very, this is very important. That's what I'm gonna say, right? So uh, immediately he's playing aggressive because he, if again if he gets a, if he hit that forward air, you, he would have got stage control. And again, advantage state, right? So yes, he's looking for it. After he hit him, he jumps. I see, he jumps again after he hit. He's looking for a guy right now, honestly. Second time he jumped off the platform and didn't did an attack, right? So when you're trying to land, he does uh, dash back and to grab, right? Again, he was looking to come up the platform and hit you again. Doll jump after getting hit. So he likes to jump after getting hit, that's what I'm saying. See, so he's cornered, you got a disadvantage, and then he jumps, right? Again, he likes to come up the platform to attack you. Third, fourth time he's done that. Ah, uh, we should have done four there. I don't know why we didn't. Again. Play, please. Thank you. Here's a free let's shot. Oh, you got away from that. I didn't know you could get away from that. <laughs> that was really... Uh, Nuchi get up early. There's a lot of steps you could do with that. Like, I've smashed. <laughs> if he keeps getting Nuchi get up at the same time over again, just I'll smash him, right? Again, early double jump. So he knows that you could cancel actions immediately after hitting the trampoline. <clears throat> so uh, after to mix you up, and what, if, uh, so uppies, most of uppies like Yoshi or whatever. Well, y Yoshi's in his case, it's down B. But there's some moves that y you can uh, mix up and you do fast fall through the platform. So he went through the platform. So when you when you did like uppie and disadvantage or whatever, be ready for that. He goes through it instead of being on top of it, right? That was scary. Because what he's looking for you to do is do exactly what you did. <laughs> he's gonna grab you here. Let's go to lunch. All right, so over there, um, yeah, you had a choice there, and you chose to charge your fruit, right, and go to lunch. Right. So one second. Sorry. You get grabbed. Good di because he could have pushed you on a platform and maybe now nah, he would have killed you. But still, right. So here, you still dodge him, and you already chose. I always charge like two fruit and then dodge here, and then you side beat. Come over here to center stage, line up the hydrant, and then play, right? But we got. We're gonna go for Bell here? Or Key? No, we're gonna go Bell here. And we, we, we went here. And again, against Bowser. Eh. We did a neutral gap from jump again. I don't like that because you waste Bell. You get. Yeah, you got 20%, and now you get to get on stage really. So it's not all terrible, right? But then. We don't have Bell to kill him now. Last thing, like, he likes to dodge it really. Do you know that's gossipy? Awesome? Go with that. Uh, you were going for ledge, I know. Sorry. Be careful when landing on the shield, honestly. Anyone that's good out of shield option in the game will watch you get looking for that stuff. So he's covering uh, get up uh, get up option a lot, right? Shield, he likes to jump after hitting you. Jump to approach. Alright, very important. I already saw that. He lost his jump. Getting out of your up throw combos. Disadvantage state, really important against Bowser, like I said, or like a thousand times already. 
He likes to double jump away first, and then he likes to attack. So you up throw him, you take his delay double jump away because you double jump to chase after him, and then you get back down and you punch whatever attack he tries to land with, right? So you could up smash him, up tilt him, and then do it, do it again over and over and over again. And you keep pushing him, and you keep doing attacking up percent, and you keep you keep him at disadvantage because now we're about to play neutral, right? And you don't you don't want that because this guy's scary. Up the edge. Uh, I I would have preferred if you put the shot right here to cover your landing. That's fine. Didn't that's again after hitting your shield, he likes to jump. After hitting his shield, he likes to jump. Roll towards you and hold shield. It's very important, by the way. In tech situations, it's very important to see what your opponent does after. The roll or attack roll or neutral attack, right? Very, very important. Hold shield, right? We're gonna, we're, we're gonna remember this and we're gonna go. Well, and platform isn't very important, but watch. I'm almost gonna tease, gonna jump off the platform. I, I have a big fat lie. That's very common. Double jump out of disadvantage again. And what did he do? What, what did he do after he double jumped? Well, he landed aggressively, right? Same thing. He didn't air dodge, he didn't do anything. Alright, so search for three. Uh, I, I would charge like Malin or something and then get in his face because now he just gets you know, double jump away and then what does he do? He's not safe like, right? But if you didn't have pursued him instead of shooting fruit, I would be surprised if you went for side B or down B or forward air, right? See? Hold his shield and then he falls off. He likes to fall off the platform a lot. Yeah, go off, do spam double jump, side B. Right? We're fine. If, if he side B's you here, we just DI to the right off the stage because Pac Man can make it back. Double jump really again. Uh, so it doesn't look like he keeps advantage shape very well. He doesn't like bait any options. So that's good for us. But if he start if he starts doing that, we gotta look out for that. Again, he likes to jump in the forward air. We could be rolling. I don't, I don't know why you're doing this. We got lucky. Why we jump off? That was scary. Again, early we, we, we gotta catch on. Those are, those are things we catch on. Also, uh, whenever people land on top of the stage and they're, they're kind of hesitant about whether or not they should air dodge, or like, uh, if they're free, then they'll air dodge. It's very common for people to dodge back on into air dodge, right? Which is a directional air dodge. So, uh, he likes to jump out of getting it. He likes to jump up here, right? And let's uh, do this here too, right? No, very important. Yeah, he's not covering rolls, so we, we realize that. Again, he's going for this again. He's going for this again. He's going for this again. <laughs> we near him. Why didn't we near him? We had a free near. We had a free near conversion there. Nooch tech and to hold shield like last time. I like the up the auto shield there. It's a good option. Double early again. Okay. You have you have orange. The um, orange goes straight. Right? So we wait a little bit or we just throw immediately. But it uh, uh, <laughs> Why did air dodge there? He likes to jump after whiffing too, I was what I'm realizing. He likes to jump. See? I was gonna say, I was gonna tell he's gonna double jump. Yep. And he's gonna attack. I was expecting the up tilt there, to be honest. I was okay, one second. I was expecting him to when when he hit and realized that he hit you instead of him holding shield. I actually expected him to do up tilt, which I was hoping he would do honestly. Yeah. We we get the win because he was sloppy uppy. Not much to say there. I explained everything during the set. Let's get into the next game, right? Um, this is game number two. We got PS2 again. It, it, it must not like it's going to be PS2 over and over again. 
No, it's it's, it's pretty. It's, it actually benefits Donner. So you're. Uh, I, I I need someone to talk to. I, I don't know no stages very well. You can, don't talk to me about stage bands and picks, whatever. But start in neutral the same way, right? Okay, after he's looking for a grab right now. Is what he's looking for. Uh, yeah. Oh, perfect. I was gonna say we can take advantage of that. We should have full up there. Well, full up fair, I think. Bam! He's obviously trying to go for a dash to, uh, attack the hydrogen, right? We take advantage of this. Bam! He hits us back, and we can recatch Galka here, and then f fair him, and then do a reset Galka combo, right? And we do a short hop instead. I think a full hop would have been better there. Let's go for grab again, like I said. Air dodge this time. This time, after whiffing his forward air, he like he dashed back instead of jumping. Double jump early again. Again, add this, add this, after getting hit, he has to jump jump. And he DIs away from you. Or attacks you if you can. He won't air dodge. Is what I'm saying. Again, off the stage. Pluff him. Again. Oh, and again. Oh, wait, that's a jump, my man. I thought it was me to get up. My bad. Yeah, don't ever roll because now we just take 20 to 30 percent. Just, just need to get up and just wait for him. Right? We got bludge. Again, forward air. We, we realized this. We we're going to take the stage to go from him. Awesome. He jumped again immediately. Again, uh, off this platform. Right? Yikes. We take those. <laughs> we got out here. <clears throat> I, I was gonna say that's a very that's a, the same thing he did last time when uh, he had a vertibility. He just charged up to you then up tilt, right? Rolls away. Double jumps away, and then he's gonna di away. Yep. Oh, he attacks this time instead of double jump away. Okay. Press on opportunity. Okay, he likes to do yeah. I was gonna say he didn't have to jump up and do forward here, but he didn't. Again. 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 <laughs> I think this is a go-to get off platform option. Double jump away, and then he does away from here. Or and if he can attack, right? After you get hit, dies away from you. Off platform again. Mm -hmm. uh, that's a good option, but I don't, it wouldn't it would definitely not have killed Bowser. It just wouldn't sick. Like, I would say 140, 130. That would probably kill Bowser at the percent with the key. I, I do like that, though. It's, uh, it's means you have good knowledge. <sighs> we kind of got a punch there. Rolls in again, and then last time he healed shield. Yep. And then he got off the platform. The, 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 I was gonna say, last time I said he was gonna jump, but this time, last time he did this. And now, uh, this time I said that he's gonna do this, and now he's gonna do this. <laughs> right? Jump and just do this is very common for after rolling or his right? He's looking for a grab right now. Dodge early again. Rolls away, and I hold shields immediately after rolling. Dodge early. Ah. Oh. Yeah. Oh, awesome. Good read. I love that. Yeah, we just take damage. It's okay. That's not good. Because you do lose um, invulnerability after you hold the H. So, it's okay. It's online. I'm sure it's hard to react to. Why are we doing this, though? <laughs> You read the roll. Whenever people like pressure, like uh, this area right here, and then the pressure jump, they'll almost always go back here and like cover the roll too. So be ready for that, right? Exactly what he did. Every single time he vulnerability, he goes on platform and it comes off the same way every single time, right? Good patience. I was actually hoping. I thought I was gonna go for grab this here. Again, double jump weight though. <coughs>
You need, you need to be punching that more. You, you should be they punched it once, but you're not doing it again. Um, you probably could have done something there. One second. Sorry. So right here. You have a hydrant here, and this hydrant's gonna push out water. So and you've got a ledger here, so you can ledge cancel. Um, he's probably uh, he did hold shield. It's, it's obviously safer if you hold. It's, it's like more consistent if you grab him and then four throw him and then like a four a fair just look cool. <laughs> get some percent, get some stage control, go back and let's trap, or follow up with a dare if you know if he's gonna dodge him here again, right? But in doing a nair there, it's. Uh, I don't know, because this is, uh, I, 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 so, uh, <laughs> Lutch cancels are super cool, right? That's what I'm trying to say. <laughs> it's up to you if you want to go for them. I go for them all the time. It was so much fun. Okay, so again, very scary. Bowser dash dancing when you're at disadvantage. He's going to grab. Also, he dashed back into grab, by the way. I did mention that like, earlier. Um, after attacking or in a tech situation, he holds shield immediately after, and then he jumps. Or if he's on platforms, he gets off sometimes. Right? Yeah. Every single time we see you jump in the area, just roll. Again. We did an accidental side B. Oh, let me in. Don't jump in the area again. We just back throw him here. Are we Mr. Key? You know what I was gonna say. Oh, okay. Those here again. Those are here again. Into attack. He should get a plot from here. Double just away again. Into attack. Awesome. He's gonna do it early here. Jump out of shield again. He likes to jump out of pressure, right? He wants nothing to do with that. <laughs> he loves Forte. Well, it went jumps out there. He didn't, he didn't need to hold shield. You should have read that. Like, you read it one time. I want you to read it again. You could have killed him. Good job. You, you orange baited him. <laughs> um, you you read the, the, the platform one time, but then, like... You never did it again. You're not reading his double jump away into attack or DI away. Um, his forward airs are very easy to see coming. Loves chopping is very easy to see it's coming. It's like mm, you're not punishing those things enough, is what I'm seeing, and that's why I get some gamer two. It's gonna number gamer three. I we're gonna do the best of five here. Um, gamer three, PS two again, very good for Pac-Man. And guess what? Same thing, same thing, same thing, three times in a row. Right, jump forward, air, jump forward, air, jump forward. Air. Should do forward air here. <laughs> like that. Oh, 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 oh! I was gonna say he's gonna double jump early again, and guess what he did? And you caught it. You caught his double jump. So. His options now are either going to be up B early or up B to the ledge, right? Those are his options. He doesn't have any, or he can actually DI this way and then air dodge to the ledge. I take it back. He has three options, right? Uh, if he decides to air dodge, you can down smash or down tilt. Uh, if he decides to go up, you just bait option. You keep jumping off and off, and then um, it, you, you kind of bait the early up B, and then you, you go back to stage and you punish that, and you push it back off and you keep punching him, right? If he goes low, then you follow up with downer or a hydrant. A downer, I think, was better, right? He goes lunch. We realize that we have a vulnerability. We have a good attack. Good knowledge. I like it. He was too close to ledge. Hold shield up in tech situation. We, we're going to the platform. He's going to forward air. Yep. He's going to do it earlier. He's going to do platform. He's going to do forward air. He's going to double shoot here. He's going to approach him forward air. Yep. Double jump away. DI away. Looking for the forward air. Oh, 
Oh, that was. Oh, the sweet spot wasn't there. Oh no. Okay, good. I like how you kind of di pass this way so you don't get punished. It's okay. But again, we we wasted. I don't like this though. You use double jump to go out the stage early, and he dash he dash back. You're gonna get punched here. You know, you should have got punched there. If you did a good side tilt, you would punch. Jump early again. I'm gonna back there, that's fine too. Again, okay, if you're gonna go for that side B read, we should go, okay, this is the 15th time, we, or 20, 30th, it's honestly, probably about 15 times. He jumped He jumped away on pressure. And we should have angled it up. Like that. Apple will kill now. And so I think I'm a melon. I'm gonna go melon here. <laughs> right, he's gonna do, oh, the air dodge this time. Mistake. It happens to all of us, but still, it's just good to know. I'm not. I'm not. What? Okay, so last time he had a vulnerability, you chased. <laughs> <laughs> we get Galk here, we go to ledge, yep. Yeah. Forward there, forward there, or forward air. Jump out of shield, forward air, forward air off the ledge. We read that again, second time, only the second time though. Double jump early, he's gonna go to the platform. Forward air, jump, back air. I haven't seen him going for a side B on top of the, the platform. A lot of battles just do this, for good reason, it's really good. Whenever he has a vantage state, he dashes back, and I don't know why. We could have got it. If you were faster, we could have got it to attack like he did earlier. He had enough range. Okay, again, throwing fruit here is okay sometimes, but like something as high as Galaga or Bell, I just feel like you're wasting it because like you could get a lot more value. But you got a lot more value. <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna shut up. Alright, so with heavies, and you're down like Donkey Kong, Bowser, K. Roll. Maybe K. I don't, I don't think you've ever seen it against K. Roll. But Bowser, Donkey Kong, 100%. Down throwing him on top of the hydrant just throws him. And I don't know why. Like, even at 0%, like 10%, it, he'll just go flying. It won't kill, but it, it, good sense for sure, right? Go for less trap. So it shows me a good knowledge there. Again, double jump really good stage. He's gonna go to the platform. He's gonna move here in four there here. He tried to. Double jump here. <laughs> you got a great degree to the stage control. could have smashed him. We didn't need Bell here. I smashed him. I smashed too, I guess. <laughs> what would be your preference, I guess? I would have gone for smash. Same thing. Would have killed him. Ah. So we knew that he likes to jump and forward air you, so we could have just waited a little bit longer. He was looking for forward air. He's going to do it. Oh, as he should be. Sorry. You know, platform is in four day. Yep. Oh, you gonna jump in four day? Don't do away. Get away. Four off the platform. You gonna jump in four day? <laughs> this guy's so simple. <laughs> jump away. He was looking for the four air again. <laughs> Uh, we could have got Bell though, you know it. Yeah, forward air again. Wait, why are we not? You read it two times. You show me that you knew how to read it. Why aren't you reading his other 30 
fall platform. We gotta teach this Bowser not to do that. He has really bad habits. Like, I care for this guy too, believe it or not. I want to coach this guy. You don't need coaching. He does. <laughs> uh, you do too, because you're not catching on to the stuff. But, like, he has very bad, bad, bad habits. Like, eh, eh. Double your way. DIY. He has very simple, simple, simple habits. And I want to coach him. <laughs> And we're, and TP, you're not reading this stuff. <laughs> you you show me that you read it twice. And I, you're not reading. You're not ever doing it again. I don't know why. Like he loves to jump out of shield, jump forward air. Look, it's like a uh a a note. Uh, how did y'all know? I'm I don't I, I'm not really good at band. It's like this. What's the note look like? Oh, I forget. Uh, four. Third, fourth. Oh, I would say fourth time he did forward air off the ledge. We could have played a bit more patient, right? Yeah. Right. He had a rage. We yeah. Um, we're gonna go to game number four now, and I really hope that something changes, and it's not just a repeat. I want somebody. I don't care if it's you or him to adapt to something. Game four. Game game four. <laughs> All right. So we get game number four here. You want two? Bowser won one. You need one more. He needs two more. Right. So guess what? I guess guess what happened? In the last three games that we played against Bowser, when he, the very first forty milliseconds happened. Ah! Four no! days. What? You're making a video right now. Yes. <laughs> I forgot where I was. I I was complaining about something about uh, him doing the same neutral star every single time. I think. Forgive me if I'm wrong. <laughs> Again, need this simple platform thing. Shield jump forward air. He's not. If this Bowser player ever sees this, please, you gotta go for these like side B mix ups. Like CPU keeps like shielding, right? We got we. Got, I, I really want you to do to side BM so I can teach CPU. Okay, he's gonna go for mix ups and then then sometimes you go for like a bait and then an attack, right? You gotta do something, right? I, I like the attack mix up there. I'm a, I feel like I'm coaching Bowser now. I'm not even coaching Pac I'm not even coaching CPU anymore. <laughs> yeah. Don't jump away. Okay, he did it. Good. Roll, jump, shield again. And then he did a, the thing. Right? But because he did upbeat, well, he still did it, but still. Ah, that's different. I don't know why we grabbed there. He's gonna jump early again. The the actually, if you had turned around and looked this way and with the up angled up E right here, um, the hydrant would have won this way. A little bit, a little bit difference, but this little difference would have hit him and it would have wasted a dodge, right? It still hit him, but it would have hit him this way and it would have been better for you. Now I'm gonna get say jump, shield jump, and then he's gonna look for a back air maybe. Or he's gonna, he, he, yeah. I'll jump early, jump again, platform. Ah oh, yes, the mix-ups. Oh, awesome. <laughs> again, he's getting value off of it, so he's like, oh yes. And he likes to do up be like a little bit earlier. Just hold shield here in this area, yeah. And then hold the go shield as soon as he grabs ledge. Because he's, he's not really aggressive much. Yeah, whenever he's. Uh, this is kind of common for everyone to do, but whenever you see someone like dash dance at the, when they're cornering their opponent, they always go for grab. Right? It's kind of obvious. It's like a. You know, like a. a, 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 a shield jump before there. Uh, if, if we like sit here instead of da dash back, we could have punished that. <laughs> nah. Shouldn't go forward here. It's a grab. Third time we've done that. 
Chip away, DIY, yep. Chip away, DIY. Or maybe actually since he's, you, you've kind of thrown the apple, he might act DR towards you and attack you. Let's see what happens. No, he does away. Ah, it's for it. Ah, you're very faster than that. Attack, shield. We can like put him in a tech situation, and if, we're, if you know he's gonna do an attack, we, we F smash him, and or if we're not fast enough, we just grab him, because we know he's gonna grab afterwards, right? Ugh. He's going for the mix ups, and I'm very, ha I'm very, very happy that we're seeing mix ups, because he's been conditioning you to shield after you're in Sidious area, because he's gonna go for all of these four now. But now, since he's doing side B, now I get to go in a little bit more in depth coaching. Now you have to look out for that side B, right? So that makes me happy. Because th th these sets will be kind of on repeat. <sighs> we could We could have done Hydra there. Again, like a little dash, dash to grab. Shield jump for there. Shield jump. Oh, oh dude, grab me some. Yes. Bowser's love to do this. They love, love, they love to like condition you to hold shield because they love to jump. They love to. Forward air your shield, back air your shield, down air your shield, uh, up be out of shield, right? And then finally, they go for a full hop and to grab. They Bowser's love to do this. They also love to go to grabs when you're holding shield on platform, right? Also, they love to DI towards platforms, and this is kind of hard, but you have to fight them in DI. It's kind of like DI to the left in this situation, so you land here instead. You didn't die, but so it's okay. But it's not okay because you lost. Okay, this is kind of scary. He didn't punish it, but still. Look, look, look at this, ready? Bam, one platform, and then, look at this. This is very, very, this is very, very important. You could have got punished here. The most common, one of the most common things to get on platform is because it's very easy, is to fall off here and fast fall, right? As soon as I saw him dash over here, I was like, okay, he's gonna get punished. For some reason, he didn't punish you. But still, it was like, he, he made the right play, he just didn't capitalize on it. What? Did he just spam back here? How did you lose that? Whatever. He likes to bump, put on, get, get on the platform and hold shield when you have a vulnerability. And then jump up to this forward air thing. I, I, instead of doing the side B, because we, we know that won't kill at this percent, is I would have done bell and to run up here. Like dash, reverse, uh, grab bell, full hop back here, right? That's what I would have done. So we keep the bell, we get more stage control, and we do more percent. So I mean, doesn't do much percent. It's like, uh, how much percent does it do? Full charge. I think it's like 10, 11. 10 percent. Well, that's interesting. Here, okay. I was gonna say, okay, no, no, don't tilt. Don't, no, no, no. Because up tilt will straight it. Up tilt will send it straight up, and up, up smash, if you up smash it, it'll send it in this angle, right? It'll bounce maybe one time, and then it'll land here, but it'll, it'll cover some area, so he has to, like, go... He has to, like, he forces him to jump over it, or... It, basically, what I'm trying to say is, it covers area, so you can have time to charge through. Instead of doing that. I mean, it works, too, I guess, if he runs over here in the lane. Okay, I take it back. That works, too, but still. I'll up smash it. Because then you would have time to charge fruit instead of getting back, right? Okay, so you're doing, a, you're doing this a lot. I I went through this with you before. It's okay. I, I just prefer if like you use like orange, like you just did. But using uh, Galica and Bell, the, the valuable ones. The key, I was totally okay with the key. Like, it, it, it sent him way over here. Like, he got so much state to show. So much value. And if you know that he's gonna charge fire or whatever, awesome, right? Throwing cherries, strawberries, oranges, like he just did. I'm totally okay with it too. Just, I don't agree with Bell or Galica ever. Honestly. We, we love it. We love the Champlain right now, don't we? Back throw. Go for last shot. I think Apple might kill here. 
Again, he has to pressure this and he has to cover roll with up tilt. Also, we can we should be kind of scared because um, he was one second. I'm jaw, I'm jaw some stuff. Here we should be kind of scared because we're at right, more forward air distance. He could have fastball here and did forward air, and we kind we even kind of di'd in double jumps, so it was a little scary. He could have definitely gone for that. He didn't do anything to cover that. We sprint up here and we do some stuff. Here. That was bad. I I don't like to I don't like to waste indulgent there. Yeah, we're kind of forced with the hatch down. And yeah, I'm gonna say you lost that last interaction because you wasted double jump there. Yeah. Also, you could have air dodged. You would have been a little bit laggy. You might have used like a jump of the trap lane, but still, you you would have not died. <laughs> right, right. So this is two two. We got a game of five coming up. You still have not shown me that you're reading anything. <laughs> so it's, it's giving us right. Oh, is that it? What? It's 2-2. Two, two. I want gate. Where's my game 5 at? But thanks for watching. <laughs> okay. Well, um. So, I had to do my little recap here. So, Bowser liked to do this. We don't want to know how to read it. We should be dash backing into forward smash, which we did twice. We never did it again. I don't know why. He likes to double jump away at his advantage and has to DI away. He likes to jump and jump early here. Uh, loves trapping, he lets the foot jump forward air or, or fire. Whenever he's pressuring you here and you're sitting here holding shield, he likes to cover here up till on the cover um, cover roll, which we rolled into it two or three times. Um, he finally turns like the last third and fourth game. He likes to do like side B mix ups here, which I really appreciated because that made you think and he learned a little bit because he likes to hold shield, right? So, and he also loves to attack this hydrant, and I didn't really see any punishes off of that. You just kind of let him hit it and then run away and charge through or do something else, right? Like, we could be doing something there. So, that's mo that's what the big thing is I gotta say with this, right? Uh, other than that, yeah, thanks for uh, thanks for watching. Hope you learned something, CPU. <laughs>